Yes, and Munan, hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Now, Mzwa Kimbuli, a seasoned poet and writer, has claimed that he is the creator of the SABC Crown Gospel Awards. Umbuli made this a revelation a day after Zanil Mbogazi Nkambuli's death was announced. Now, Uzanil Mbogazi was the one who received credit as the founder of the SABC Crown Gospel Awards. Despite being the original founder of the awards, Umbuli had to step aside to focus on other endeavors he said in a condolence message to the family of the late ukos fm broadcaster the crown gospel awards are my brainchild my idea but i decided to let zanella continue with it because she was still honoring the gospel musicians who were overlooked for the longest time Udalimbo, who was the SABC Group CEO then, he can attest to this. I never fought with Uzanel about this because I was happy with how the awards turned out. All I wanted was to see gospel musicians respected and honored because their genre was big and still is. According to Umboli, he never kept quiet about his connection to the awards. Most people will ask why I kept quiet when she was still alive. I did not keep quiet. History has no blank pages. The people who know that this was my idea used to repeat the phrase that the nation needs to know that I, Mzwa Kimboli, am the founder of the SABC Crown Gospel Awards. He said that he was shocked that Uzanele Mbogazi has passed away. Mzwa Kimboli claimed that during Women's Month, the nation lost two significant female artists in a matter of days. The news about the passing of Zanel Mbogazi shocked me. Cancer is ruthless. May God strengthen the bereaved family during this period of grief. I would say um, I had a good relationship with Uzanel and I hope I will have time to go to the funeral. Now, Zanil Mbogazi passed away at 52 on Monday following a lengthy fight with cancer. Now, there you have it, Mzansi. Do let me know, guys, what you think in the comment section down below.